Welcome to Grumpy Guy Gaming and today we're going to unbox Actum Panzer German Tank Force uh, Which is cool uh, You get five German tanks we'll, When we open the box we'll see more So let's go to the table and check it out And we're back and let's see what we get inside the box So the Germans So we get the Z Tiger Ah, straightforward, not many parts, which is nice. There's some metal parts. Which is cool, we have some bases and characters, which is even nice. Uh, we have another tank, and the Panzers. More Panzers. Panzer. One more tank. This is, I think, Jag. Then we have tokens. Ah, nice that they can show the way who packed it. This looks nice with some. Now we have some flame markers, cards, more flame markers, tank cards. Let's see what we get. Come on! Again, everything is marked up who packed it, which is cool. So we have a skill, so no cards. We have different tanks, so all the German, the German tanks, which is cool. Me Panzers, medium tanks, there's a lot. We have some special characters, which is nice, plus we have some back. Oh, there's a lot of here. There's even different. Cool. So that's the card. We have some transfer sheets. We have some... Oh, these, these are nothing. We have some... Panzer 4s and this is King Tig Tiger and then Jagd Panzer which is cool not bad so, now guys I need to assemble the tanks and come back short and this is the German side so let's see what we get so we get 3 Panzers I think it's 4 this Jagd Panzer and a Tiger so I've done 3 different configurations and probably different uh, uh, years of the war so easy more or less easy to assemble there's some the tracks is a little bit fiddly but nothing spectacular looks cool then we have I think this early war I think we're probably going to use these uh, this as uh, uh, Africa core one that's why I put the this cap on then we have Yak Panther, which small little tank, which looks cool. We have the late war Panzer, which with additional armor. And then we have the Tiger, standard one. Cool looking model, big, which is cool. Then we have officers, tank crew actually, which you can use practically for. Come on. For officers in bolt action, which is nice. This one, this one, and on knee, on his knees shooting, which is cool. And that's it. And that's it, uh, what to say, cool looking models, historically, so not, not not a big spectacle, everything is, if you read anything or watch it, uh, uh, war movies, World War II movies, you mostly seen these tanks, which is nice, game itself is cool, 
looks cool doesn't seem too complicated i'm still waiting for the starter set <laughs> so soon maybe uh the cards are cool so you get a bunch of tanks even the ones that are not in this box which is nice we get the aces card we get the german uh, cards we get german tank aces uh you get the uh, crew of tanks you get storage which is nice you can individualize your tanks if you want more uh, all the panzer fours that you get can be made different periods so which is nice uh, we get yak panzer and that's it uh, and i noticed that the game also has cards have uh, from different time periods that can be used so it's cool should have maybe checked more the cards talked about them so sorry about that uh, model wise assembling it was more or less straightforward there's some tight small bits that break off if you're not careful which since i think some of them are actually talieri models uh if i'm i'm not 100 percent sure i think they are but i don't want to be to say something that's not correct without checking easy to assemble more or less nicely detailed um, that's it uh, leave a comment below tell me what I fucked up in this video subscribe to my channel if you're not a subscriber hit the bell button to get notifications when I upload a new video and thank you for watching and stay grumpy